Sorry, I was pretending you were useful. <laughs> oh god, Balthier, you made him cry! Dude, he cries if you tell him leprechauns don't exist. What? God damn it. Assassin's Dagger. We stole it off some fag named Altair. Wow. I'm not okay, broad axe. Axes are actually really powerful, and I could equip it to uh, Bosch, but the thing is, is that the damage isn't consistent, so they're really kind of useless to me. Huh. I like people in RPGs with axes. Well, it's because apparently one dude looks like me, and he always wields an axe, and he dies. Which depresses me. Because I resemble the dude who dies. Oh. That's not fair, I don't want to resemble dying dude. Yeah, th these are stones are from the uh, Urutans. You certainly stocked up. Empty your pockets, everyone, including the inside pockets. How the hell are we keeping all this stuff? I don't know. Bizarre! Okay, we have a light spear and an iron forged blade. I don't know what either of these two are, but I'm going to get it! Get them. A javelin! I already have that! An iron sword! I already have that! Yay! Two completely useless items. Oh well. Sup, lizard people? Stay out of our way and find me shoe locker. I see right. a wall. Time for our regular visit to Kajin. How's she doing hey, today? Isn't this this bitch you're always mean to? Yeah. Great. It'll never happen. I really hate being mean to NPCs. I really do. Especially one that doesn't really wear much. Yeah, I mean, she doesn't wear anything at all. I mean, the least I could do is be nice to her, right? I mean, she doesn't have any money for clothes, or maybe she's a prostitute. Actually, or maybe she's just Faye Valentine. Once you go to the city of Vieira, you find out that they don't wear a lot of clothing at all. Well, You're don't. not invited! He's not invited. He's still not invited. Okay, he, he's not invited. You Did should you wear some my, clothes. Didn't you watch some... Uh, hey, wait a minute. Was that Yang Sung? I don't know. Did, 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 you, did you just walk past Yang Sung from Soul Calibur? I might have. Fuck. Regen, Esna, Arrow, uh, Balance. Area damage equal to difference in casters, current, and max HP. I can use that, I guess. Then, pretty insane. Oil, berserk, confuse, gravity. Gravity, stay the hell away from me. Purple haze in the sky! That's what Jimi Hendrix sounds to me. I know, but Jimi Hendrix was awesome. Just like the fact that Ozzy Osbourne snorted a line of ants once. So, wait, who's the guy that I walked past? I thought it was him, but that's not Yang Sung. Okay. He's got the baggy trousers and the bandana, though. He says I'm out. Okay, so what do we do now? We shall consult the high wind of which is blue. Uh, mark battle and... Like, what else? Is that it? Yeah, that's it. Uh, yeah, we could do a mark battle, but you know, I I don't wanna. Hmm. Because I'm a. So what do we want to do now, Brain? We buy equipment. Oh, another fact: the guy who voiced Brain from Pinky to Brain also voiced Orson Welles in The Critic. Oh, wait, really? I yeah. Didn't watch The Critic, though. I quite like it. Although it's not on anymore, and that depresses me. Silk hat. Fran cannot equip this. I refuse to part my ears. <laughs> um, let's see. Windbreaker? I'm trying to look at what's good. 
a windbreaker seriously? You're selling tracksuits? Okay, there we go. These are good shields. Um, let's go with two. Oh, Schnikey's it. Took out like a lot. Schnikey. Um, golden armor. I can only buy two. Um, I'm sure I remember this one way of getting golden armor in a in a bazaar. Uh, Golden armor. Well, I can't even get two. Shenanigans. Um. Joaquin Phoenix. I love it if you come back at the end of the game and that woman is hung herself. Actually, depending on what you say to her, you get different items. Blue Highland says to be a jerk to her, so I'm going to follow what he says because, well, Blue Highland is law. What if you get, like, a kick in the nuts from her? Well, you get an item, and I don't think a kick in the nuts is an item. I don't know. You could get kicked in the nuts and you get ball cast. That'd be an item. A cast for your scrotum. I'm just. Well, would you rather walk about with broken balls or balls to cast? I I, I don't I don't I don't, even, I don't even know what to say to you anymore. I, don't. I know. I like to disturb people that way. Oh, our first katana. We could get it, but I don't have the samurai, so you know. But Whoa. Also, crossbow, serious, and elfin bow. That's so racist. How people always assume elves have bows? Because they do! No, I'm just saying at one point there should just be some elf who says, No, that's racist. That's fucking racist! Not all elves have bows. Look at me. I have a broadsword. I do not have a bow on my person. may be going to sleep soon enough it is. Jesus Christ! Yeah, but it's like 3.30 for you. 2.30, but close enough. What's with all these dudes hogging the street? They don't have any place else to be. They're homeless. What, what can you say? I mean, you can't just boot them off the street. Oh no, I have a theory of what we could do with the homeless problem. My dad says that's the great thing about dating a homeless girl. That's you can drop her off anywhere. Oh. <laughs> He's very inappropriate. Well, I've got something better than that. What we need to do is get all the homeless people together <laughs> and have a tournament in which they beat each other to death and the winner gets to stay in a five-star hotel room for a week. And then we do the same the next week. And the week after that, and the week after that, and the week after that. I'm pretty sure that goes against all human rights. I'm pretty sure it does, but imagine it. Bomb yeah, bites would be entertaining. Turn on the TV, you see a bunch of homeless people going at each other like and condemned. My dad says no one has any rights, he doesn't give them. He's, he's claiming to be Chuck Norris right now. Oh, good for him. Alright, well that's about it for this segment. Indeed. What are you laughing at? No, I'm done anyway. 
did run me off. You don't have that kind of power over me. Who do you think, who do you, think you are? My dad? Oh, wait. You are. You know... You... My dad just claimed he was Mary Queen of Scots. And an astronaut. Leave Mary Queen of Scots out of this. We had to cut her head off. Why did you guys have to cut her head off anyway? She's a bitch. Is that the only reason? Essentially. So is that us done? Can I stop the hour and a half long recording? <laughs> yes, you can. Alright. Later. Ciao. <laughs>